And welcome back. A dress code controversy at a Sacramento high school. Some students at West Campus High say they won't be able to wear most of the clothes they own. CBS 13's Anna Giles is getting answers on how this policy compares with other schools. It's a new school year for these West Campus High students, and what they're wearing is getting a lot of attention. You don't want to be in something uncomfortable just so that you're following a dress code. Students say they were given this, a new, much stricter dress code policy that specifies how long shorts and a shirt must be. I immediately thought, like, what clothes do I have that fit in this dress code? Overall, it's unfair because the rules seem to be more targeted towards women while they relatively or boys are unaffected by the new rule. At West Campus, the new dress code requires shirt necklines to be no lower than two inches below the collarbone, and shorts can be no shorter than three inches above the knee. Even the shorts that I'm wearing right now are pretty long, and these are some of my longest soccer shorts. I can't wear those. A spokesperson for the Sacramento Unified School District did not want to comment on camera, but sent a statement saying the West Campus dress code policies mirror the district's policies, which do not tolerate any form of discrimination. So we wanted to know how do the dress codes at other schools compare? Guidelines at McClatchy High are much more general and just require students not to show private areas. The dress code at Hiram Johnson High was even more general, simply stating, quote, clothing must not interfere with instruction or other activities. West Campus students are now asking that the dress code at those schools be part of the model for theirs. They said that you could find it in clothing stores, but in like our experience, it's been kind of difficult to find clothes that you like that fit you well and that also fit within the dress code. The district says they are trying to find a compromise with students they think misunderstood and mischaracterized the policy. We're not children anymore. You know, we're exposed to tons of issues and the decisions that adults make affect us right now and in the future as well.